Hi everyone, today I want to talk to you about my new micro PC. So just to give you a little bit background, well I have recently sold all my previous rig, the oh, my mount, my uh, telescope, my everything essentially and I wanted to build a new rig but budget friendly rig. Uh, so you might have seen my previous review of uh, Melly Quieter 3Q. That's a great computer, by the way, if you want to uh, buy a computer that is in your budget, uh, go for it. It's a good computer to use. But because I'm going budget friendly, I wanted to look at Facebook Marketplace and try to get my hands on something that is m more budget friendly. Uh, for folks like us who uh, don't have a lot of money in our bank accounts. So uh, I've got this. This is called um, uh, Optilex uh, 3040 uh, and it's, like, it's a micro PC. It's not a mini PC. It, it weighs a little bit uh, and uh, it can be used for astrophotography and that's what I have. That's why I have bought this. It's got, uh, let me take you through a few things that uh, why I have bought it. So uh, first of all, it's i it's got i5 uh, processor, which means that it's uh, very, very fast. Uh, it's got 32 gigabytes of uh, RAM, which again makes it very, very fast. Uh, for most other PCs, mini PCs, you get RAM uh, around 4 GB to 8 GB, but this is, you know, 16 to 32 gigabytes of RAM, which makes things uh, very easy and smooth. Uh, it's got four USB uh, 3.0 um, USB ports, and it's got two other ones. So it's got six ports, uh, essentially, and it um, has a Wi-Fi antenna, which is obviously very essential for uh, if you want to control your mount remotely. Um, it's got a lot of things going for it. It's got uh, Windows 10 Pro in it, which which makes it easy to do to use Windows on uh, remote uh, desktop software. Uh, Windows 10 Home Edition doesn't have uh, doesn't allow remote control for some reason, but this has a uh, Windows 10 and I got this for 150 uh, US uh, not US Australian dollars so 150 Australian dollars is uh, I think something around 120 USD or thereabouts um, and I'm gonna use this to power my rig and do everything uh, do the the computery bits uh, use this to do that uh, now, obviously, this is not a perfect solution. Uh, the thing that is staring me in the face is that it's 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 heavy. <laughs> it's a uh, it's got a it's a huge size, um, so you can't mount it on top of your telescope or in your you know side of your mount. Uh, you have to put it um, maybe underneath your mount or or somewhere else. Uh, there are many ideas around, but uh, it's not. It's portable, but not as portable as 3Q Quieter Pro, for example. It's uh, another thing not going for it is that it's uh, uh, you know a 3Q um, Melee 3Q one uses USB um, five volts, so you can uh, take it with you anywhere really. But this one needs a DC power supply. Uh, that means it is limited to where you've got a power outlet. So I use I use my uh, telescope usually in my backyard. I don't uh, take it out out in you know dark skies or any of that. I'm very much uh, a backyard astrophotographer. So uh, this works for me. So if you are like me who um, use this rig, your rig in your backyard, this uh, I can recommend this. But if you are someone who wants to take it out and about, I don't think this is for you. It just is too limiting in my humble opinion. Uh, I think uh, overall, I, I would 
highly recommend it to you if, only if, uh, you are on budget. Uh, this works perfectly well uh, and I think you wouldn't have any complaints. Uh, and another thing about this is that while, um, you know, those mini computers, you can't really use them for uh, daily, day-to-day -day life, but this computer can become um, your second computer. You just unplug it and uh, uh, bring it home, essentially. Um, and it, it is powerful enough to do most other office stuff. Um, so I think it's a great addition to my uh, rig. And uh, I'll tell you uh, more about it as I go through. Uh, I've just installed all the apps in it and, you know, Nina, PhD2 and all of those sorts. Uh, and I'll tell you how I go with it. Uh, but for now, I just wanted to share my thoughts about uh, uh, if you are, if you have budget uh, problems, if you if you don't have a big wallet like many of us, <laughs> I suppose, uh, then you can go for something like this, and it will serve you well. Uh, these are dirt cheap. You can get them from hundred dollar to hundred and fifty, depending on their configuration, but. Uh, this will do do you well. Uh, all right. Thanks, guys. Uh, thanks for uh, listening and being here. Uh, please uh, uh, write down a comment or if you have any question or just comment. Um, it's always good to hear from you.